Cool. Um, I wanted to uh, show this particular wall sconce, this Art Nouveau wall sconce I've designed and fabricated. Uh, this is a stainless steel bowl on the top, by the way. And this is a uh, somewhat difficult forging in mild steel. This is three quarter inch solid square bar, and it's tapered in both ends um, to start with. Uh, this is actually six feet long. It doesn't maybe look like it, but that's what the length is. So I've started with a four and a half foot bar, and using a, a traditional forging techniques with a, a forge and trip hammers, me and my partner uh, tapered these out uh, into a nice graduated taper on both ends, and then I have built a jig that would uh, give me this nice spiral on the top. Now, uh, originally I intended this to be a lamp prototype, and what my idea was was there, there was going to be a glass bowl in here, um, and I was going to offer this, this difficult forging in both left and right spirals, so that uh, what I was imagining was that these would be sconces on either side of a grand entrance. Now this idea has morphed a little bit, and in this configuration, in this iteration, this bowl is going to hold water and a, a spiky plate inside of it called a frog, which holds cuttings. So this can be used in many different ways, but I just thought that the, the uh, form itself, the vortex, was just such a lovely form, and it related so well to Art Nouveau, which is one, one of my favorite styles to work in, that I went to the trouble to make the jigs to, to, to um, reproduce this in both left and right. How wide, how wide is the bowl on top? This bowl is about 14 inches wide, and I do make this uh, uh, in longer tails with the same spiral. If we move over here, I can show you another one. And this has, uh, this has a much longer, this is almost a four foot tail on this one. And you can get a different angle. Now you can see the plate that I put against the wall. It's got a, um, it's larger than the other one because the tail on this was, I was trying to get, to keep with a, a nice configuration of scale, a nice composition. There's a keyhole shaped hole in the back of this. There's a plate on the wall and that, so it's only one uh, hex uh, bolt in a stud that holds this whole thing. And it's, uh, since it's a keyhole shape, it, you slip it down on it, and even if there's an earthquake, it's not going to come off the wall. But, so this is another uh, way to, to um, kind of feature this lovely shape. Just thought it was a nice form, and uh, kind of a showboating of uh, traditional uh, blacksmith techniques, but with a modern look to it. Somewhat modern. I love organic forms, so Art Nouveau is really my favorite. All right.